Having not won since May 14th against Hakoa, the Spartans under-20s boys needed a big performance here at home against St George FC. With Guns N' Roses' Welcome to the Jungle blaring in the background, the boys looked light on their feet, primed and ready to go. As you can tell by the change in lighting, the majority of the first half saw both sides struggle to create any real opportunities. This free kick, which was won by Paul Apostolopoulos, was then sent way over the bar. This chance here almost became an unwanted own goal, thankfully, just a corner. But then finally, towards the end of the first half, a good bit of pressing by Riley Chapel, which found the ball at the feet of Apostolopoulos, whose striking instincts were fine-tuned. A strike from great distance, looping over a hapless goalkeeper and putting the 20s one to the good. Assist Chapel, goal Apostolopoulos. The last chance of the first half would come to the one-time goal scorer, but he instead donated this ball to the neighbours' wanderers with this powerful effort over the fence. Straight into the second half, though, a throw inside the first minute or two, Riley Chapel turned from provider to goal scorer, showing strength and the ability to turn on a dime, and finishing wonderfully at the keeper's near post to double the advantage. 2-0 Spartans. Chapel then wanted to turn back to provider. This wonderful curling through pass sent Apostolopoulos on a run in behind, but St George's keeper was first to it. The long throw into the box would again prove too hot to handle for the away side. A scuffle before Big Paul would have his brace. Now the boys had the three points in the bag. A clean sheet was their next task. Chapel was having a top game, but wasn't going to find his double this time. One of St George's best opportunities of the match, but the striker had too much time on his hands and ended up putting this over. The final chance of the 90 from a St George corner, wide and ultimately unthreatening. It would bring about the final whistle of the match with the 20s boys worthy three zip winners at home. A confidence boosting result. Up next, the boys go to SD Raiders away from home. Let's see if they can carry this kind of performance into the Southern Districts.